Oh wait, so every time I take a video, my problem is always the audio. Now I have here a recorder, and uh, let's take a look at if it is good. So like I said, we are going to take a look at this voice recorder over here. Now, um, might be wondering what's the reason we have this one. Well, it has something to do with uh, the new normal that we are expecting. Is a teacher will be needing a lot of uh, gadgets to record audios and uh, videos now. For videos, we don't have that problem because we already have our cell phone. Now, the problem with the cell phone is that when we are going to take a look at the audio in the post-production, sometimes the audio is a little bit crappy. Now, in the video world, people always say, experts say, that it's okay to have, or sometimes it's better to have a crappy video than to have a the audio so it's very important to have this one now sometimes also it helps when you're having a when you're covering something like a performance and you want the audio continuity uh, while taking videos of the surrounding this is a good way to save the complete audio while taking a lot of videos on the surroundings without cutting the audio so let's take a look at this, let's unbox this product, this is Raymax RP1 and this uh, of course as usual with all the products that we have, it is made in China and uh, it says here it records a high definition audio, it is a noise reduction, the specification here is that it is 62.5 grams it has an OLED screen that is for you to monitor. It has a USB interface, USB 2.0, it's a micro USB. It has a memory of 8 GB which can be extended to, you know, uh, you can add 32, something like that, depending on the size of your memory card. The, the voice or the audio format can be MP3 and WAV you can put music here with an mp3 format WMA WAV APE and FLAC okay now it has an airphone output and it has uh, what is the battery it has a 260 milliamps battery now according to the cover it can record up to it says there 32 hours and it is 8 gigabytes so let's take a look at it so it slides up like that so we take off the box and here comes another box so oh, the box is actually really good you can reuse this one you see box to place something important like Necklace, other gadgets. Okay, so there you go. I already removed the top box. Let's just put it over there. And by the way, what you're watching in the background is one of my favorite sitcom, Big Bang Theory. I really love that show. Okay, now back to our review. So we have here the gadget itself, and then this box over here. Let's take a look at what's in there. So I'll just take this off. This one is the recorder. Wow, look at that. It's very small. Let's just put it aside for a while. <clears throat> and here is another box. It's a box inside a box. And inside the box is not another box. It's actually the particle analysis. This is the headset. And this is the USB 2.0 micro USB. It's a kind of a bummer that it's a US micro USB, but then this product I think was made in 2017, so it's a micro USB. And let's put that one over there. And 
this one is just a foam for the uh, gadget it has a certificate of I don't know certificate of authenticity maybe because it has a QC pass thing over there now it has a manual and like every other thing made in China it has a Chinese instruction and on the other side is an English instruction with sometimes a lot of erroneous English like for example this one here number 11 menu key it became menu key it's M-A-N-U well I think we can use this gadget without reading this one already so let's me just put this box so that's it everything is out so let's keep those bucks away for a while and so this is the headset so I don't know if you can maybe you use this one you use this one to monitor the sound while recording I don't know if you can do that one we'll try it later on or you, or you can use this to listen to music it's quite long and this one has this is a foam for comfort you're going to use it and of course you already know this is the USB connector is used for charging and for transferring file to your computer now let's go to the gadget itself so this is the voice recorder now to make it final let's peel this off there you go so in front is the screen this is the screen and the red one here is the recording button this one is the play button this also serves as a power on and off uh, in, the man uh, in the manual it says there's soft off and on okay so I'll tell you later why it's called soft on and off now on this side it's like the left side is the backward forward and forward button this is the volume and that's the micro USB con um, port this is the micro microphone and by the way in the front I forgot to tell you this one is the speaker now you can see the holes over there and on this side this is the right side this is where you insert the memory card this is the hard power on and off slider so why do I call it slider because you're going to slide it up to turn it on there, there you go it's on now you're going to slide it down turn it off and this is in this one is the menu button so and this is in the other mic at the back nothing is in there it's like the brand name and it was designed accordingly by Remix made in China blah 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 now it is actually made up of metal so you see that <laughs> so it's good it's, it's actually feels feels good feels premium and it's very small look at that one what can I compare this to like uh, let's see my memory card is here Let me just up here so this is the memory card it's very small actually and it's very light so you can easily take it anywhere you go and uh, maybe while shooting a movie you can just use this one like that and record the audio of what you're shooting now let's turn it on Remix okay, there are no files yet so there you go uh, how to navigate this one you can use the um, this buttons here to navigate it and for your menu you use the one over here so menu okay, press and then the forward and backward button you use this one to search now we have this recordings ebooks I think they're talking about audio book here it's not ebook actually so you can uh, store ebooks here and then listen to it while you're on the right it's usually what I do while I'm writing so folder view now when you want to open this one you press play okay now record I don't have anything right now because this is actually very new now when you go back you press M 
Okay, now let's try the recording. So I'll be recording. Let's listen to it later on. So I'll just press this one. So please wait. Wow, takes long. Okay, now we are already recording. So I'll just say hello, hello, hello. This is a Remax testing of the audio recorder. Mic test. Hello. And press the red button again to stop. Now it's saved. Now we can play it like that. Hello, hello, hello. This is a Remax testing of the audio recorder. My test. Hello. Okay, so that's how you do it. And then you just pause it. And there you go. So, uh, what do I think of this product? Well, it is okay. Um, I have tried using it. I tried to sync some audios that I've taken with a video that I made a while back and it's good. Uh, it's good for its price and uh, it serves its purpose because it's an audio recorder. So, and actually when I used this one to I thought it's gonna I thought it's gonna what do you call that? monitor the recording but I th think it's not so let me try <sighs> because when I use it the first time I didn't hear anything oh my goodness I'm using a an earbuds right now let me just take the other one there you go okay oh so it was turning off let me just turn it on again one two three okay so that's the soft on. So for example, this one is on. If you're not using it, it will turn off automatically to save power. And then you can just long press the play button to turn it on and off again. So let me try recording. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Testing, testing. One, two, one, two, three. Okay, so nothing. You cannot monitor the sound while you are recording. Let me just play it again. So let's play. Okay. Okay, so that's it. Now, what else can you say about this device? It's actually lightweight. Now, we can use this one to record meetings when uh, we're tired of... Let me just put back my audio buds again. Now, uh, we can use this one to record meetings. Um, like for example for bloggers like us we can use this one to record our audio and uh, it's a cheap remedy for a mobile blogger if we don't have a shotgun mic and it's actually good it's good for its price do i suggest for you to buy it uh, well you can but actually it's uh, it's outdated but still usable so that's it for today for our gadget review there you go an audio recorder that you can buy on a tight budget so if you're interested you can always uh, go to your gadget store and find remax rp1 that's it for today have a good day and be safe